Hey bro chicas, welcome back to another video. For today, I have a huge, massive Dollar Tree haul. This, I know I've had huge hauls before, but this is genuinely the most I've ever spent in one trip at Dollar Tree, so it's going to be a huge haul. Um, I just look blah, and you're gonna see this same look in another video as well, because I'm going to be filming my Walmart haul right after this, so just a heads up, I don't got time to be changing and stuff, so I look crazy, I have a lot to do today, and I don't even have my tripod. I don't know where my tripod is at the moment, so we're gonna have to do a rinky-dink setup so I can show you guys what I bought. Okay, y'all, this is gonna be the best that I can do. I have all eight of my bags here. Sorry, this seems like this is like a little off center. Okay, yeah, so these are all the bags and we're just gonna go through them as best we can. This is gonna be a really weird, weird way to haul stuff, but I picked up a stain lifting laundry detergent this actually works really well it does take stains out so i picked that up because i'm running low on my tide and i was trying to save money i picked up these two suave shampoo and conditioner in the scent juicy apple green this smells really good i don't know that i would say it smells like apple i guess it does whatever it smells like is so fresh and beautiful and i wasn't gonna get it. it was the only one that had shampoo and conditioner and i wasn't gonna get it because i was like apple i don't know about that but once i smelled it it smells so good you guys so this is by swab so i picked that up for my daughter's bathroom i also picked up a white rain hairspray for my bathroom let me get a thumbnail in here next bag I got two of these Glad Febreze Freshness Hawaiian Aloha trash bags. It controls tough odor. And these were actually uh, a good value because normally you get five at Dollar Tree and this came with seven each. And these are the tall kitchen size. I picked up a salt shaker and a pepper shaker and they look like little mason jars and they are so cute, but I think it would be good to have my spices obviously in the kitchen, but also a set on the dinner table. So I bought two of these and they are glass. I needed some paper plates and paper bowls. So I just picked them up at Dollar Tree and I got two packs each and it's just got this cute little teal green and navy blue print on it you get 15 plates for a dollar and 15 nope 10 bowls for a dollar so i just picked two each of that i'm gonna turn it this way i also picked up two shelf liners in the black shade um just for the cabinets and and or pantry i don't know where i'm gonna use it I think probably the cabinets on the bottom where the pots and pans are. So yeah, I just picked up two non-slip shelf liners, non-adhesive. It's 12 inch by 60 inch in the shade black. I got some Welch's fruit snacks for the kids while I was there because they like these. I also picked up these two little Bugables mosquito repellent bands. Easy to use, citronella formula, deep free. And yeah, so you just put these little bracelets on the kids and hopefully the mosquitoes won't get near them. Um, I just picked up two because I want to try them out and see if they work. I've always seen them at Dollar Tree and I've never tried them, but I think that would be good to have for the kids when we play outside. I got a black pepper because I was running out. Also picked up four bags of these spicy, hot and spicy peanuts. So these are really, really tasty peanuts, guys. Um, my husband loves them and they haven't had them the past few times I went to Dollar Tree, so I got four of them for hubby. I also saw that they had LOL bandages and um, since I only have a few band-aids left in my stash and the kids are always needing a band-aid or asking for a band-aid, I figured I, they should have their own for their bathroom and it actually comes with 20 band-aids. Band-Aid bandages, it comes with 20 band-aids. Oh my gosh, I'm not put together if you can't tell. Um, but yeah, 
really really cute my daughter loves lol and austin likes lol too and so i just decided to pick up these band-aids for their bathroom got one of these painting sets it comes with this little dip tray and a roller and a paintbrush because i'm going to be diying my nightstands i'm gonna be painting them a different color and so i needed a new rolly foam brush so that it could be faster and easier for me to paint and I also picked up an additional bigger softer brush that they have there so this is a two inch paint brush and this is softer than the one that comes in there that one's one and a half and it's like a different color so just so I have options to see what works best for my little DIY paint project we got time to kill so I'm just you know gonna be DIYing stuff so I can make it fit the decor of my new home. Speaking of decor for my new home, I picked up two of these bathroom hand towels in the gray shade because gray is very prominent in my home decor and this was the most perfect gray and it's gonna be great for the guest bathroom. And you know, these are not bad quality for being a dollar to be honest with you. So I kind of wish I got four of them, but I just got two for now. I didn't want to go too crazy. I can always get more later. I got some of these shower curtain rings, just the clear ones for my kids' bathroom. Just easy peasy ones. I think I'm gonna sit now that I have gone through a lot of the bags. I can bring you guys a little bit closer. Okay, here we go. So I got two of these organizer baskets and I got these for the fridge because I was thinking we could organize the jellos and the yogurts. My husband always eats those sugar-free jellos and then we always have yogurts in the fridge and like little doles, peaches. So we could just organize them in here in the fridge. I'm gonna be doing tons of organizing, tons of cleaning, tons of DIYs in the next couple of months because obviously we just moved and I've got a lot to do. So I was just keeping that in mind. Anyways, my eye is twitching so bad right now. How's y'all's day going? How are you guys? How's everything? Um, I picked up a shower curtain liner and this has magnets at the bottom. Whoop. I just got the clear one. That's for my kid's bathroom. Some fabric softener sheets because I was running low and I really love these fabric softener sheets from Dollar Tree. If you see them, definitely get them. It's called Final Touch, that's the brand. It's spring fresh scent and you get 35 sheets for a dollar and they're big sheets. So it's really awesome. Oh yeah, they're jumbo sheets. So you really only need to use one for a big load. And so you get 35, that's amazing. The smell of these is so fresh and good and actually lasts on your clothes really, really well. So I highly suggest that one if you find it. I needed to grab a new litter scooping brush because the one that I have for Bailey right now is kind of like yucky and it's just gross. You should just replace them often. You know what I mean. Um, the last time I went to the grocery store, the acetaminophen, Tylenol, whatever, was completely out of stock. And I've been getting headaches like a mofo lately because the allergens have been so bad here. Like the mold has been really high and I always get like migraines. So we, me and hubby have both been getting like migraines lately. So I picked these up because they didn't have regular acetaminophen, but I saw these by Assured, which is the Dollar Tree brand. So we have an aspirin, aspirin free headache PM. So it says compared to Excedrin PM. So this is supposed to help migraine like headaches, I believe, but you take it at nighttime. So it helps you go to sleep if you're having a really bad headache. And then I also got the tension headache relief. And this is supposed to compare to Excedrin tension headache, which is sometimes what I have, where I have like this headache all across here. It hurts to open my eyes. And then it feels like the headache is going down into my jaw, like as if I've been clenching my jaw for hours and hours. It just completely hurts like a helmet. So this is acetaminophen and caffeine. 
So I picked those two up to have because we go through Tylenol like crazy with our headaches. And then here's some fun stuff. Here's some makeup beauty stuff I found. I actually needed a new eyelash curler because mine, I've been using it for, like, I wanna say like two years. And so the little rubber thing has like a hole in it. Not a hole, what do you call it? Like a slit from pinching and pinching and pinching. So I just picked up one of their purple ones. And you guys, Dollar Tree's eyelash curlers are actually really good. They're functional, like don't sleep on them. They're only a dollar and I feel like you have to replace them, you know, every one or two years anyways. Um, I also found this Bolero Jasmine Orange Blossom Eye Cream and I hadn't seen any eye creams and I finally found this in the Mother's Day section. They have this little section set up with a bunch of like spa type items for Mother's Day coming up and I was so excited because I need an eye cream. I actually don't have any eye cream. Oh, I have like a tiny bit of the Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair Eye Cream, but that's so expensive and nice. I try to savor it, but I like to have a refreshing morning eye cream. And I used to use the Origins one because it has like a citrusy awake feeling to it. And so that's why I thought this Jasmine Orange Blossom would be great for the morning and daytime. So it says it's for all skin types and it's an eye cream. And of course, I will let you guys know how I like it. I've been really liking Dollar Tree skincare lately, so I'm super excited to try that. And I also found the LA Colors Plump Gloss. I was so excited. They had every shade there. They had it in the most random section ever. They had a bunch of LA Colors. So make sure you look everywhere in the store if you're trying to find new makeup because they just put it so randomly. It was right across from the graduation items really weird so yeah i got mine in the shade shocker which is kind of like a beigey pink and it says it instantly plumps lips tingling sensation and it's got a little bit of sparkle in it so again i will let you guys know how i like this i'm super excited not that i need any more lip but you know we do like a big lip and then I picked this up finally. It's not like this is hard to find, but I've seen so many people say how amazing this highlighter is for $1 and that they use it over their expensive ones. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna treat myself and pick it up. Do I really need a highlighter right now? I'm not really going nowhere, no. But I really, really wanna try it. So this is in the shade Shine Bright and it's kind of like a champagne gold where it's not too gold, but it's also not too white, and it just looked like the perfect color. So I'm excited to see if this is really good. A lot of my favorite YouTubers have been saying it's amazing. My eye is twitching so bad. It's like so frustrating. I also was lucky to find the large jade roller. I do have the small jade roller that they came out with at first, but of course I had to get the big one because I'm gonna be treating myself and having spa days. I've got my bath salts and I've got my beautiful new bathtub and I'm just gonna be doing masks and all kinds of nice stuff. Maybe I'll make a video on it of me having like a pamper day with Dollar Tree products. That would be fun. Let me know if you wanna see something like that. Give it a thumbs up. Give this video a thumbs up and comment below. But this is a really nice size jade roller, so definitely wanted to pick that up. I also saw that they had this new LA Colors nail polish line where it was called Soft Neon Colors and i saw this yellow and i've never had a yellow nail polish before but i kind of thought it would be cute because i do like a neon nail polish but this was like a yellow soft neon and i was like i don't know let's try it i also thought my daughter might like it so i feel like i'm going to share it with her one of these days like maybe when i have my pamper day i'll probably paint my nails and my toes and paint hers as well i just thought it was like such a cutesy little yellow I don't know. I've never had yellow nail polish and I was like, you know what? I'm feeling it. I'm feeling weird. Let's do something weird. Let's do something different, right? And I picked up two of these metal garden hooks, but I'm not going to use them for gardening. I'm actually going to use them to hang my purses in my closet. I saw somebody do this and I can't for the life of me remember who it was. I'm really sorry because I would give them credit if I could remember, but I remember watching like cheap Dollar Tree closet organization videos and somebody said to use these to hang your purses and I was like that's a great idea so 
I got two two packs, so I got four to hang some purses on those. Since we're on the closet subject, I'll bring this bag over here and you guys, you guys, just look. I haven't seen anybody haul these, which is amazing, but just look how absolutely gorgeous these hangers are. So they've always had the black velvet with the silver one, but how interesting is this gray with this copper? I love it, or rose gold, whatever you wanna call it. I like to call it copper, but oh my gosh, it is just so absolutely stunning. And like I told you guys, gray is the main color in my decor in my new home. And I really wanna have mixed metals. I know some people don't like when you mix metals. They're like, just choose one. I love the look of mixed metals when you do it tastefully and you do it right. So. I mostly have like chrome and I have a coffee mug this color and I just want to incorporate it in little different spots in the house, you know? So I figured I could use these hangers in my coat closet by my front door um, because I would have to spend so much to get enough hangers of these for my closet, even though I would love it. But for now, I was like, let's just do it for the coat closet because that's what people are going to see like if they come over and you know it's just really down here with all that decor i don't know so it's like a part of the decor i guess so you get two for a dollar but i picked up four packs so that i could have eight and we could all hang our coats in this coat closet with these beautiful hangers oh my gosh gray velvet and copper guys i don't even can you, are you grasping this though like are you are you grasping this though? Like this is really cute. Like this does not look like a dollar for two of them. Girl, no, this looks like some fancy target ass. You know what I'm saying? Like this is, this is gorgeous. You need to get your hands on these. If you see them, get your hands on them. Cause once, once people start realizing this is there, they're going to fly up the shelf. I know it. And over the, over the door hook. I already have one of these for my room but I got one of these for my kids' bathroom so they could hang their towels um, on the bathroom door. So I picked up that for them. And then I also got two of these beautiful bath bombs. I've never seen this type of bath bomb at Dollar Tree, but they look like galaxy, kind of like pink and green. And it has a galaxy background. There's a little bit of blue in there also. And it says it's a bath burst. So yeah, I just got two of these, one for my daughter and one for me, cause I figured that she would wanna use one. Every single time we go to Walmart or Dollar Tree, she's always looking at the bath bombs and she always wants to use them. So I was like, I'm gonna get her one so she can also have a pamper day, but I wanna try one too and see if they're any good. So, okay, I was so excited to find these guys because I've seen people haul them and I hadn't seen them in my Dollar Tree until today, but I'm super excited. So this is the Global Beauty Care Pore Refining Hydrogel Face Mask with Aloe Vera and Tea Tree. It's a 15 minute facial therapy. So it's a gel, like jelly mask. Like you can see it, you can see the bubbles. So I picked up two of them, girl, if I could, I would have picked up all of them, but I didn't want to be rude. And then also I had already been spending so much money, but I definitely picked up two because I'm going to want to do this more than one. So I'm super excited to use this pore refining. Yes. Anything that makes or tries to make my pores smaller. Yes. Give it to me. Got a Firefly Anti-Cavity Fluoride Rinse and this is for Mila have to do the anti-cavity she's prone to cavities just like me she has she has gotten so many cavities already and it's literally genetics like i asked the dentist my dad's always had a lot of cavities and i have too so i always try to make sure i get something that's anti-cavity for her and she's out of her mouthwash this is in the bubble gum and it's the lol dolls and she's obsessed with lol so like as long as you get those kinds of things in the cartoon characters that your kids like, they'll want to use them, you know what I mean? And I got body wash for my kids. This is the White Rain 
kids body wash and it's a bubble bath too if you want to use it as that it's tear free that's really why i got it because my son really hates when even water gets in his eyes so i wanted to make sure it was tear free and it's the pure splash smell it smells just regular good clean smell so i hadn't seen this one in dollar tree before so i picked it up so I saw this in the Mother's Day little section and I thought this was super, super cute and goes really nicely with my home decor. So I just picked it up, even though I shouldn't be buying home decor right now. I should just be buying the things that I need to organize and essentials, but I couldn't help it. It's got all these green little leaves and then this just like wooden color border and it says in this house we do laughter we do hugs we forgive we dream big we do loud we do love we do family and i thought that was super super adorable and they had a few different ones i know they had a purple one but i'm not sure what it said but i picked this up i'm not sure where i'm gonna put it yet i just couldn't pass it up I have seen this many many times and i've never picked it up and i was like you know what I'm going all out today. I'm just gonna pick it up for the bath, mostly for the downstairs bathroom. But this is kind of like that poopery, which is usually really expensive. I think it's like 10 bucks for that poopery. My kids are yelling at each other. But you spray this into the toilet before you go number two, and it helps it not smell. So this is the lavender vanilla scent, and it's a toilet spray. It has up to 300 sprays for 100 uses per bottle and it keeps the sink oh it keeps the stink in the bowl is what it says so that's pretty cute we love lavender in this household so i picked it up since we're going to be doing a lot of hanging and decor and all kinds of stuff in this house i picked up some nails and i picked up this picture hanging kit so that we can hang all of our decor Feel like we're always running out of nails they're all probably in the walls of my old house right now okay we're down to the last bag you guys last bag this was like such a long we're at 25 minutes right now you guys i'm trying not to talk too much but it's hard all right so I got this kids spray on detangler for Mila. She is always having issues brushing her hair and it's always super tangly. So I got her a detangler and I hadn't seen it there in a while. And so it really jumped out to me and I was like, oh my God, I used to buy that for her. Why haven't I bought that for her? Because I haven't seen it. So this is a watermelon scent. This is just one of those um, paint scrapers that I got to go with my DIY stuff. I picked up one of these and I would have got more if they had more, but this was the only white one they had, but this is super like farmhouse, really, really cute. So I think I'm going to change out the flowers that I have in this vase on my table and just put this little sprig in there. And this is Queen Anne's Lace. That's what it's called. I thought it was baby's breath, but this is really, really cute. And it is that farmhouse look that I'm going for. So I got one of those. I also found these um, grow kits and I thought this would be a fun thing to do with the kids. And it's a forget-me-not grow kit. And then a daisy grow kit. And they had one other flower there, it was pink. I'm not sure what it was, but a lot of these were smushed. So I found the two best ones. This one is even smushed a tiny bit. But this comes with, this includes the pot, the seeds, the growing medium, and the instructions. Because I don't know how to grow plants, so I'm glad it has instructions. I definitely had to get a kit. But I thought it would be really cute to do this with the kids and try to grow some cute little plants. And yeah, that would be fun. I needed a new candle lighter. And also hubby uses these for lighting the grill charcoal. So we were out. And lastly, I'm so glad that I found Cascade. Yay, because they didn't have it last time. And a lot of places have been running really low on dishwasher fluids and packs. So I had used the Dollar Tree one. It works okay, but it's not the best. I definitely prefer Cascade. So if you do need to use a Dollar Tree brand, 
it does get the job done but only if your dishes are like not that dirty like if you have anything like peanut butter on a knife or something it's not going to take it off so just a heads up you're gonna have to like kind of like pre-scrub your stuff and rinse before you put it in so that's why i prefer cascade definitely works the best they had a lot in stock so i picked up three packs because you only get four in here and i do dishes minimum once a day so i decided to just pick up three just in case i don't find it again okay you guys that was it for this dollar tree haul this huge dollar tree haul oh my gosh i have a lot of work to do now i think i need to eat something though um but thank you guys for watching i really really appreciate it give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed this essentials and home organization home decor haul and if you are not subscribed already please be sure to subscribe i am always making dollar tree haul videos if you like things like that and walmart hauls and clearance hauls and all that good stuff Basically, I try to find the deals. So if you like that kind of stuff and vlogs and lifestyle, please subscribe. And anyways, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.